Salem's Lot. The 2024 take on Stephen King's novel starring what Lewis Pullman, which I come to find out is. It looks Bill just Pullman. like him, bro. Bill Pullman. Well, I didn't know it was his. He looks like him. Uh, Sorry, on H- steering on HBO Max. It's a vampire tale. Um, <laughs> yes, you've been muted. Uh, it's a vampire tale about a small town being inundated by vampires, being being overrun, going to be taken over by vampires. Mm. Uh, I feel that this movie was um, heavily, heavily edited. It was heavily cut down because there's a lot missing. I don't know if you saw. It. You're not me- you're not muted anymore, by the way. Oh, okay, cool. They are a fool. <laughs> I don't know why you're pretending being dumb, but uh, I don't yeah, pretend to be dumb. The yeah, the uh, wait, you've read the book? No, no. So if you watch the movie, you can tell there's things, there's parts of the story missing. I'm watching the movie. I didn't. I, I'm not all full disclosure. I have not seen the original Salem's Lot movie. I have not seen it. So I have no nothing to base myself off of or anything like that. Uh, this movie was a fine. It was an OK vampire movie, but it's it's an OK monster movie. It's missing a lot story wise. There's I was, I was I'm watching the movie and they they bring points that they never they never explain. Why did the writer go to this? Why did the writer come to town? What's the point? He didn't. He never. He never. They never explain why he comes to town. So this movie, I think, was it was actually from what I I heard a while back. It was supposed to be a series. When's no, it was all, movie? no, it was it was always supposed to be meant to. I did the research. It was always meant to be a movie. It was never meant to be a series. It was always meant to be a movie. They edited the movie down. It there is a full movie out there. The director Gary Doberman made the full movie. See, no, but it was Gary. Never just men and Gary, but it was heavily edited. <laughs> like it's a, it's what's oh, it like? It's like a ninety minute movie. Uh, it's a short movie. Uh, I liked the look of it. It looked nice. It looked good. Like ambiance wise, I I was in it. I was in the movie. I enjoyed it. I was like there while watching it. I enjoyed everything was happening. Everything was happening. I like, I liked it. I just wished they didn't edit so much of the story out. That didn't let me flesh out was didn't let it doesn't didn't let make sense. Flesh yeah. Out. yeah, things didn't make sense. Like he returns to town after a while, he keeps bringing up the ho- the that home. Well, he keeps bringing up this stuff. None of that gets explained. Of the, uh, that's the beauty of the seventy nine movie, which I love, by the way. That they actually do explain why he goes to why he's so obsessed with the Marston House. Well, isn't because isn't the, the original one a miniseries, which is the uh, seventy nine one? Yeah. Right? Isn't that doesn't it get longer? It's like this. The this one's only given. What, I'm telling you, it's like probably about ninety minutes. It's a short movie. It's an hour and fifty three minutes. Yeah. So it's 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 not that long, and it feels like they cut all. I a hundred percent know that they cut a lot out. I didn't. I didn't believe the relationship between between uh, mm-hmm. the writer Ben and uh, the girl, the young girl. They went through that very very quick. The, Instantly the, in love very quick there was no build to it no. uh, have you seen his eyes? have you seen his eyes look at his eyes i know he's dreamy for sure yeah, he is. He's, he's he's adorable he, he looks like the dad in casper um but <laughs> <laughs> no but they, there's there's like there he, he, he looks he looks like he's going for the space balls they they went like uh by the editing they went more for ambiance and like background and like just making that movie look nice and I like the way the vampires look. That I like the glow in the eyes. I like yeah, the special effects. I like the cinematography. I liked all that. Which is it in the 79 beautiful. one too. Yeah, yeah, but I I think the movie looked beautiful. The movie looked great. The story just wasn't there. But I it did that doesn't mean I didn't have fun with it. What I got with the monsters and the vampires was enough for me to say mm, it's passable. I enjoyed what I got with it. I wish. I wish they would have given me given me more of the story so I could follow like follow what was happening, like actually flesh out everything else. Because yeah. I, 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 I yeah, you didn't give more, you time to care about the characters. I didn't care. It completely pulls away from the book too. That's the problem. Well, so I, there's yeah. a lot of people that are fans of the book. I mean, it, it really pulls away from it. Like I didn't care for the familiar, the the first guy that that 
that that oh, is Renfield. watching uh, Renfield. Yeah, the F- Renfield dude. I didn't care for him. He's in the movie for like three minutes. That's it. And he's a big part of the book, and he's a big part of the seventy nine too. Striker in the uh, yeah, whatever his name is. What Striker? Striker? Right? Yeah, Striker. Then you. In the, in the 79 one, he's played by James Mason, which is a great actor, by the way. And then you got this guy who's, yeah, like you said, he's only in there for three minutes. James he Mason. does nothing. Does nothing. Does, no, no one, that's a problem. In this movie, no one does anything of he's worth to, to care He's supposed about. to be charming, but it turns out to be just very he's creepy. Just, he's just there in the movie. He Weird. Like I same way. Wait, I don't mean, don't uh, relax. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, relax. I can't say that word. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> it's okay. I'm yeah, trying. You're creepy. <laughs> there's Stracker. There's yeah. There's just then there's uh. I I like the way Barlow looked. The the vampire, the too. vampire you're, king, or Dracula. You're, you're I call, I'll call him Dracula. To me, he's Dracula. Nosferatu. <laughs> yeah, Nosferatu. That guy, like a, right? Nosferatu. With the blade too. Yeah, yeah. He like, looked, like he, yeah, he looked like a you mix of weird. that. His head is so veiny, it looks like testicles. It's crazy. Mm-hmm. It looks but, better in the 79. I'm see, sorry, I, 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 I gotta compare. I, I haven't seen, seen the 79, 79 one. And, I, and, and I'm, I, at, at this point, I'll watch it just because I want to get, I want to know the rest of the story. I, I liked what they did. I wish I would have gotten more of Ben Mears. Like, why did he go to the town? Explain to me why he went to the town. Give me, he, give he me. He goes help. to the town because he's obsessed with that house. Because when he was a kid, he went into that house and he saw a entity. And so he's always been obsessed about how evil that house is. You see, they should have explained that in the movie. None of that was explained. And by the end of the movie, I'm like, okay, well, why did he go to the town? What was the point of it? All he said is, I'm here for research. Yeah. And it was a re- He was writing a book about that house and the evil and in it. Evil can be inherent in a house. And then give me a better, give me, fill me in as to why, like the whole relationship with him and Susan, right? Like him and the girl, like there's no build between that. And it, they really just threw away the fact that the guy was mad that he was, he was hooking up with Susan. Yeah. Right. They threw all First that stuff all, was real quick. He gets put away. in the hospital oh, in the 79 one. It's, it's that dude. Uh, clin- <laughs> See? Clinically speaking, it's called stooping. Okay, they're not hooking up, they're stooping. But go on. Is that what you want to interrupt? Okay. Um, <laughs> the, and then the whole, I think there's no backstory as to why the father is losing his faith. Like, they're, they're not giving me much on that either. Like, I know, like, he's a drunk or whatever. Yeah, they they introduced him. They should yeah. introduce him. But why is he an alcoholic? They don't give me any backstory on that. Probably they, Irish. I'm not Very drunk. Much. I'm Irish. I'm Irish. Hey, well, yeah. But, <laughs> His last but name they, is Callahan, by the way. But they, but they failed. They oh, failed to do so much in this what movie. What are you doing there? Right? <laughs> what are you drinking a little the devil's whiskey? They failed to do. They failed so much in this movie with the story. But yeah. to me, that's the only problem I have with this movie is the fact that it felt like like they made it in a way where they they were probably going to give you some little extra stuff that is actually in the book, but they forgot to do all that. No, you know what it felt it like? Still, it looks like uh, it. So this is the best. This is the best best way I could explain watching this movie. If you're ever watching a long movie and you just hit like skip, like like speed through a movie really quick, and you're watching like dude, 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 that's what it felt like. You're not catching the main. Yeah, I gotta point, go back. But you're like, oh, you're watching these. You're just watching the main point. Why is this movie? That's what it feels like. It's like click when he accidentally like you fast forward it, but then every once in a while you fast forward through his life. That yeah, kind of that's, like, yeah. That's 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 how I would akin this movie to because you're it's not like getting any Ozzie, actual story. It's like when Ozzy uh, clicks forward when the the plumber walks into the house. Yeah, yeah. Or yeah. the guy's delivering the pizza. I'm a pizza delivery boy. Yeah. Or the girl is no, stuck in no, the mom no, is stuck in the to, dryer because I need to find out what flavor of that pizza is. What <laughs> toppings? <laughs> toppings. Because he comes in saying that that you know who wanted the extra sausage, but it's all pepperoni. It's annoying as hell. Yeah, details yeah. or details plot holes plot holes yeah uh but <laughs> no so but I, that's, that's, kind of, that's that's <laughs> that's the problem with this movie is that it feels like you're skipping <laughs> they're just skipping through like the script it's like let's go through from here to here but there's this part that was supposed to fill in like the whole point of ben mears the whole give me stuff about father callahan they with Alfred Wooder's character, I liked her character, and but she's the doctor. And then all of a sudden, give me the rabies medication. 
why did she decide rabies medication okay, that out of anything? Why, she, why did she have that in her purse? Why, yeah, why would she carry... I mean, like, don't you? I do it all the time. <laughs> it doesn't... Like, a lot of this... Uh, and then, what's the and whole point? Does, with this? And how does Mark know that it's Barlow? The, He's like, oh, like, I gotta go kill him now. It's like... Well, the little kid, right? That's, that's, little, that's the little yeah. kid, right? That's yeah. the little kid. Which gave me it vibes. Like it gave me it Stranger Things vibes, which I didn't really care for. They, they, that how does whole he escape from uh, the the not? They didn't show. Yeah, how did he? How did he do well, all he's, that? He's, like, he's he's into magic, and he's been in the beginning. When he was trying to get out, and he punched in the face. Yeah, see, but but it's very it's quick like, that I'm they. Practicing, it, trust it, me, I'm practicing. They don't build to any of that. They don't no. build anything. Plus, the, that's that the old, hard. That, they don't build to any. They don't build any of that in this movie. They, that's the thing about this. The, the, the movie looks nice. That looks great. The story is the story is not there. Uh, the but the 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 vampires are there and the 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 blood is there. There is atmosphere is what it does have for what it for the scenes that it that it uses it in. But it's too little. I like it's a movie that it it's okay to watch, but if you watch it once, you're gonna see that it's missing a lot. Yeah. No, I like that it felt like it felt like it was bringing back a lot of the the original uh, vampire lore. You know, the whole like instead yeah, of like yeah, you yeah. know instead of romanticizing it too much, it's mm-hmm. really just like, hey, uh, it's a sickness. Uh, these guys are flying now. They got red eyes, shiny eyes. They've got yeah, yeah. They, the, the sun burns them instantly. The inviting, inviting into the yeah, into yeah, the, the, the old school. See, like I, I'm well, really Stephen now. King wrote this after after he had read Dracula. See and and I'm see after watching this and seeing that Barlow looks like Nosferatu, I'm I'm interested in seeing the new Nosferatu movie that's going to come out pretty soon. I'm interested in seeing that. Isn't one. that the Voyage of the Dimitri? The no, the, of Dimitri. no, the no, the guy who movie. did the guy who did the uh, that Conan movie, the guy who the the, the one that gave this uh, Momo Conan. The inspiration, no, the inspiration Momo of Conan. Conan. The inspira- yeah, the, the inspiration of Conan. We 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 reviewed it. The one with Skarsgård. What was the name of that movie? Oh, what's the name the of that Northman. movie? The Northman. So the guy, Robert Eggers, he directed The Northman. He did that other movie with, uh, he did the other movie with with Robert Pattinson and and uh, Willem Dafoe. The, the Lighthouse. He's Ooh. he's he's doing. He did. He directed the Nosferatu. Is Nosferatu, and he's and not, and his brother Skarsgård is Nosferatu. Mm-hmm. Right? Really? Yeah. The the uh, Bill Skarsgård is Nosferatu. Uh, you, you're, yeah, we're getting. Really I, I'm inter- I'm interested in. I'm interested to see where that one goes, just because it's it's vampire season, baby. Don't bring that one up. <laughs> Don't bring that up. I this, mean, it's, this it's an natural transition. Nosferatu, crow, boy, kills no, him. not and Dracula, dead and loving it. Dracula. No, 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 no. <laughs> Uh, that's the reboot. Jim Neeson is the comic genius. Uh, no, but but if you watch this movie, I I. I, I didn't have a horrible time with it, but you can see the problems the movie has a hundred percent. Salem's a lot. Movie. It's a complete. Has a, yeah, it, and it's missing a lot. And hopefully, if one day we get a director's cut that, that adds all these things to it, they like Warner Brothers completely. If they if they're the ones that went in there and butchered the editing and took all this stuff out, if they release a director's cut and put in. All those things that are missing, I would watch it and see just just for me. The because, Snyder cut, <laughs> even though he had nothing to do with it. But uh, no, I, I would see it. I would see it just because I liked the way the movie looked. I liked the direction. The direction. I just didn't like the editing because they edited out every. They edited I, out the story. That's the problem. It, it was the whole story was edited out. Yeah, but I say then watch the seventy nine one. You you have everything there. Plus the the special effects aren't that bad for a TV miniseries. Maybe I'll, I'll I'll check it out for sure. I'll definitely Plus check it out. To peruse it now. You got Hutch from Starsky and Hutch. <laughs> hey, and it's also available on uh, on Max. It's on Max. That that's where this movie is. It, it it's one of those movies that because it was edited out so bad, no faith well, to put put it in well, theaters. Warner straight has to, been, straight well, to Warner Bros. has been dropping the ball on released movies. Like well, either either they're no because they're releasing crap out there that is crap. Like you, you kind of you're like going. All right, let's have yeah. a watch this movie. But yet, it, they're still and they're shelving stuff that people are kind of decently they're getting decent approvals for. Mm-hmm. What is up with that? I don't know. I don't know. What's That's... up with that? Uh, well, if you saw Salem's Lot, what did you think? What did you I think? Told you I in, the, it. in the comments, oh, that, in the yeah. right in the comments, what you thought? Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. On that note, this has been Vinny. This is Ozzy and. We'll see you guys next time. 